Hello one and all and welcome to YouTuber Review, a show where we go through some of the biggest names in YouTube and analyze them for their quality of content, the current status of their channels, and the personalities they put behind it, while at the same time giving them a minor helping of criticism, but only as long as you spell minor like this. On our last episode, the Wheel of Selection chose none other than Magikarp Used Fly, a comedy gaming YouTuber who is mostly known for his League of Legends actual champion spotlight. And even though he does cover other games at some point, let's be honest here, League of Legends basically takes up 90% of the content that's available on this channel. Which isn't at all a bad thing, I mean it's the meat of his content and he does a really great job at it. You know, it's just how YouTubers specialize with what they do. He specializes in League of Legends and Keemstar, well, he specializes specializes in being a dick. It's natural. Now you might be sitting there asking yourself, what Whiplash? What, what are you talking about? He does League of Legends videos. What, does he do Let's Plays? Does he teach you how to do stuff? Do, what are these actual champion spotlights I hear about? Okay, but before I get too deep into this, I would just like to say one thing, and that is that I have actually never played League of Legends once in my entire life. And basically all my knowledge from the game comes from these videos. Yes, best source I know. So, don't be expecting me to start saying like, oh, if you combo this Q with your E, and all your ults and everything. Yeah, fuck that. That shit's not gonna happen. I'm literally just here to watch the pretty videos and give my subjective opinions on them. But that being said, let's just go ahead and dive right into this channel. Magikarp used fly according to his about page actually tells us pretty little about him. I mean, all it really has is that he plays League, his upload and stream schedule, and his business email. Which I know just stands for League of Legends, but I like to imagine he's laughing at anyone who took the time to look it up. Oh yeah, and also he joined the site on January 31st, 2014. And over that time has grown a massive fan base. I mean, look at that number! That's a lot of splashing! And to make it simple, his channel's genre fits into gaming, but not the type of gaming that that you're probably used to with PewDiePie and Markiplier and stuff like that. No, his videos are actually high effort, high editing type of videos that take days to produce. So much so that they can even be classified as comedy sketches. But as said before, his League of Legends actual champion spotlight are what take up the bulk of his channel. But he also does full gameplay videos which don't have as high amount of editing but still have quite a bit of it. Fan mail videos, crate unboxing videos, and also entire video tutorials of how to create the finest click bait thumbnails in the world is beautiful take 10 but as customary we should go ahead and take a look at his first video that he has ever uploaded to the channel a video that goes by the name of how to season 4 Yep, you just get some white text in the corners of the screen and some gameplay where if you've never played the game before in your life, you have no idea what you're looking at. The video itself doesn't even have him talking in it and it just has some kind of probably copyrighted music playing in the background. Please don't strike me. And hey, that's not even his first video he ever produced either. I mean, if we really wanted to go back, we could pull from this shit, but unfortunately it's not posted to his channel except for in reaction videos. So if I were to rate his original videos on the channel and give him a score just solely based on that, it would probably be a void at all costs. Because that type of video is super low effort and there's not even a personality behind it. However, we still have his newest video to check out. Which, lo and behold, is another League of Legends video, but it's an actual champion spotlight on the champion Kled. Let's take a look at it. Hey guys, guess what's my favorite kind of burrito? Carne asada. <laughs> Welcome to League of Legends Actual Champion Spotlight featuring Kled, the Cantankerous Cavalier. Yep, Kai! Hey everybody, it's your least favorite League of Legends YouTuber, Magikarp used Donkey Copy, that keeps saying cringy, unfunny jokes repeated constantly until he reaches the 10 minute mark so he can be placed into the YouTube algorithm. Today we're going to learn how to play Kled before I decide to commit suicide. It's beautiful, I love it, take my retention time. Honestly, the editing has been stepped up tenfold. He actually talks in the videos and actually makes really good jokes with them, and actually helps describe what's happening on screen if you've never played the game yourself. Honestly, a lot of times you'll walk away from these videos actually feeling like you learned a thing. Likely it's gonna be something that you forget five seconds after learning it, like in a Vsauce video, but hey, you learn it nonetheless. But that's okay, because a lot of times you're not here to learn things, you're here for the lols. And boy does he deliver on that front. It's like Trinimir fucked a crocodile, and this is the evil spawn that came out of the creature's vaguba. Fuck me in the ass, cause I love Jesus. 
But now's probably a really good time to say if you get easily triggered by basically anything, you probably aren't going to want to watch him. Because it's basically guaranteed at some point this man right here is going to trigger you in something that he says in one of his videos. Really, there are no limits. From bleach jokes to 9-11 jokes, there's no limits. Literally anything is fair game on this channel. Which for me, I don't mind it at all, but some of you out there might not be if you're not the average Leafy fan. I love this guy but I fucking I also just goddamn I hate this guy and that's actually a secret passive abusive relationship seriously if you go into this guy's channel expecting family friendly humor you're gonna have a bad time seriously don't go to this channel expecting that because that's not what this is you know this channel is basically centered around a demographic that's the complete opposite of rice gum meaning 18 plus and for no other reason than to prove without a shadow of a doubt this point Alright, there's just some things I gotta say about this champion is not very PG, so kids, cover your ears and don't get between me and your mother. He is a cock gobbler, an anal whore, a douchebag, a Donald Trump supporting shit eater, retarded cum stain that has an IQ the size of a baby's dick, string bean looking ass fuck nugget, donkey fucker, boner breaker, Sam Pepper fanboy, lion maker sympathizer, ass molesting cockroach like a fucking sheep herding big bad wolf motherfucker that probably would have voted for Sarah Palin if he had the fucking chance, hoodie wearing dumbass looking fuck you this is talent there's a lot of anger okay i'm sorry you got you guys can uncover your ears now he's a fucking cunt yeah if any of you listen to that with your parents present in the same room i apologize i tried to warn you sorry for potentially getting you grounded but now let's talk about magikarp used fly and who he is as a person first off his name is matt castro he loves league of legends like a lot he recently lost his father this year, which by the way, I did watch that video when it came out. Man, I'm really sorry he brought a tear to my eye. He looks like a this, and he spent $340 for one skin in League of Legends. What the fuck, bro? This wasn't worth it at all. But the last thing we have to look at before we give him his ultimate ranking is if he actually holds to his schedule, which it looks like he actually does. He still seems to upload two videos a week, one of them being a champion spotlight and one of them just being a gameplay. Or at least something almost equally as entertaining. But with that being said, it's time to give this Magikarp a final rating. For those of you who aren't aware, we have four ways we rate channels on this show. We have subscribe, check them out, maybe watch one of their videos, or avoid them at all costs. So what score does Magikarp use Fly get at the end of the day? In the end, I'm going to have to give him a check him out. His channel itself has a unique kind of comedy to it that may not be for everyone, but if you enjoyed anything that you watched here, there's probably a good chance that you're going to like the rest of his stuff, but if you didn't like anything you saw, well, there's a good chance you'll likely hate him. Then there's also the fact that many of you may not be a League of Legends player and not know anything about the game and might not be interested in content revolving around it. However, if you're like me, you just stay for the funny videos and just enjoy it no matter what. But at the end of the day, that's your decision to make. I'll leave the link to his channel down in the description below, so please go check him out. But now is once again time to choose next week's victim. You have to be literally kidding me, I just added this guy to the list yesterday. And again, Spoozy, one away from being chosen. I really feel bad for him at this point. But I guess next Wednesday we will be covering Wild Spartans, a fellow commentary channel. So keep an eye out for that one, it'll be great. Seriously though, I just added this guy last night. That being said everyone, thank you all so much for watching. If you liked this episode, please hit that like button, and if you really liked it, hit that subscribe button, I would love a new addition to the Snake Army. Please go and check out the person featured on today's episode, Magikarp Use Fly. He is a great YouTuber, and even though I did give him a uh, check him out rating, I really wanted to give him a subscribe, but his content was just a little bit iffy, and I knew a lot of people wouldn't really like it, considering his main demographic is League of Legends players. But if you are in the opinion of you don't like that stuff and you don't want to see any of it, I have three other amazing options chosen right here down below. Go check out any of them. They do great stuff over there. Honestly, I cannot recommend their stuff highly enough, so please go check them out. They really deserve it. But once again, guys, I hope you did enjoy. I will see you on the next one, as always. Let's get the hype going for next video. I will see you there. Whiplash, signing out. <laughs>